Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, we were in the middle of dumping some stuff, because uh, I got all of my stuff done that I said I was going to do off camera, which I did. Uh, a whole bunch of golden rings and stuff I need to sell off, <laughs> but that'll be done at, probably at, uh, Solstein in Raven Rock, because I finally got the dragon bone great sword done and over with look at that oh look at it it's so good but uh i don't have any of the enchantments put on it yet because i also managed to get my enchanting all the way to level 100 as well and got the perk for two enchantments on the same item now i don't really have all the supplies to be uh, ready to do that currently so we're going to wait on that for the time being. Again, I'll do it on my own time. But uh, currently, we're sitting damn pretty right now. We got basically all that we need to do to be able to go over to Solstheim and kick some fucking ass. So I think that is the best possible way to start an episode. <laughs> well, currently. Anyway. Another way is uh, with, you know, death and destruction and sadness in my life. You know, that's how it usually goes. <laughs> anyway, let's continue on. Let's see how it goes outside the house. We'll see if there's any threats out there. Because sometimes there is. Looks like right now there isn't. Good. Alright. And we got all this taken care of. We're all basically as good as can be so i think right now we're going to huh um i don't remember that being there what is this uh visit the museum and don't oh yeah that that's a thing that's still sitting there that i need to do hmm uh <laughs> I guess I still have some uh, loose ends to take care of here. Uh, okay, well, we're going to go to Solstein for now, and we'll be coming back from time to time, so it's not like we're going to be completely gone forever. Just right now, not so much. <laughs> not so much needing to do those right away. I love the soda during the uh, loading screens because uh, that helps my brain function. <laughs> At least this early in the morning. I need the caffeine, man. I need the caffeine. Keeps me functional. Alright. This is an ugly motherfucker. There we go. Oh. Nice to know, but I didn't want to talk to you. Alright. What are some of the things I needed to do over here? I needed to uh, go up to that one fort, if I remember right, and retrieve the ancient Nordic pickaxe. That's another thing I needed to do. But first, I should probably talk to the townsfolk and see what I can sell off before I go off and gallivant towards uh, saving them and their people. That is really early in the morning. I'm going to wait a little bit. You know, just wait it out take my time just let it go by so that way I can actually sell some of the shit there we go now where are the people they're not out yet uh, of course oh, there's that one um, is that an enemy over there okay then I guess that must have been outside the wall because I see the guards getting all uh, antsy, pantsy over there. Okay, let's just see who I need to talk to to uh, get my junk Want sold to off. Want to buy anything or just laugh at our misfortunes? Um, n not laugh at your misfortune. I want to see what you have for sale. Take a look. Okay, sounds good. Oh, you're the uh, general store, looks like. Oh, yep, you are definitely the general store. <laughs> That's for damn sure. Okay, let's see. I can buy that off you. I need all the healing potions I can get at this point. 
So, I'm going to do that. Uh, get some extra empty uh, soul gems, because I ran through a fuck ton of the ones that I had. <laughs> a fuck ton of them. That's for sure. Alright, now let's sell off all of these. There we go. Good stuff. Now let's sell these. Come on. Oh, uh, turns out that he doesn't have the cash for the rest of them. So, let's see what else we can buy off him to try and circumvent that. Make it a bartering sort of thing, you know? Give him more product and I end up with all of his coin. <laughs> but we'll see how that works out, huh? Uh, currently doesn't look like much can be done in that regard. Nordic era. Oh, this is basically the same as Elven Arrows. Eh, that's not good. At least not for me. I'll buy the Plentiful Stamina. That, uh, that helps too. To have something like that. Um, hmm. I should probably sell off the Shield or the Circlet. Which one has the more money that I can get out of them? Uh, I can sell that one. Yep, that works. Just fine. Do you have spell? Oh, do you spell? <laughs> do you sell any special mining gear? Mining gear? No. Hmm. However, I used to sell East Empire pendants until I ran out of them. Oh. Popular little item. Really? What's an East Empire pendant? It's an amulet that was made exclusively for the East Empire company. Oh. They gave them to their workers as an incentive at one point. A kind of reward for extra effort. That sounds They're cheap. no longer being made, so they've become a collectible. Oh. I'd love to get my hands on a few of them. Where can you find them? They could be anywhere on the island. The mines might be a good place to start. If you find hmm. any while you're exploring Solstein, bring them here, and I'll pay you for them. That's a good idea. I will definitely do that. Because why not? I'm going to be here for a while. Okay, do you know someone called Mirak? I think I maybe had a dream about someone with that name. Did you? Tell me about your dream. It was very strange. Was I building something? A shrine down on the beach near the Earth Stone? I'm not sure. Huh. Yeah, that, that little shrine we've investigated before, and it seems everyone gets dragged over there in a unconscious stupor and just builds up the shrine. So, are the sales that bad out there? Bad? Out here? What if I told you that you're the first person that's even considered looking at my wares today? Oh. I've half a mind to contact my friends at the East Empire Company and see if they need an extra hand in Windhelm. Probably not going to go well. I'm just telling you that now. You have friends at the East Empire Company? Oh, absolutely. In fact, I've corresponded with Vittoria Vici herself more than once. Oh. You know, the lady who runs the East Empire Company warehouse in Solitude. The biggest warehouse they have in Skyrim. Ah, I see. Okay. Ah, you're just like the rest of the folks around here. Hey, I believe Mark you. my words. The East Empire Company will return to Ravenrock. And when they do, I'll be at the top of their list. Sounds good for you, not as much for the rest of them, so... The East Empire good. pendants are scattered all over, so leave no stone unturned. I will not do that. Uh, that's for sure. Whoop. Who are miserable. You? Just miserable. Oh, I hate this place. Fair enough. Hmm. Always a pleasure to watch when a man like you walks by. Huh. It gets lonely out here, you know. On this remote island. Well, that... That statement? <laughs> I don't think I'm going to ask you about Merak. I think uh, I'm going to... Don't gonna... stay away for too long. <laughs> uh, I was laughing a little bit too much. <laughs> oh, hello. Are you looking for a handout or something? No, no, not particularly. I'm There's just a little... A I'm just liking that. <laughs> What's the point trying to make a life here? Well, that's you a good question. Rock too. Horrible, isn't it? What, you don't like it in Solstein? don't like it. I hate it. Oh. Every day it's the same thing. We open the shop, we hardly sell a thing, 
We close the shop and go to sleep. Uh -huh. What kind of a life is that? Why not return to Morrowind? Oh, believe me. I'd be on the first ship off this miserable island if I could. Ah. I'm not sure I could do that to my father. I think it would break his heart. Oh, I see. We've already lost my mother. I don't want to leave him alone. How did your mother die? We lived in a settlement, perhaps a league from the border of Black Marsh, the homeland of the Argonians. Ah, oh, I see, yeah. Even though the Argonian invasion ended a long time ago, there are still a few scale skinned clans that live within our borders. To put it simply, mm. they attacked our settlement and slaughtered almost everyone. Jeez. It was horrible. That sucks. I'm sorry. Good lord, I didn't realize that uh, some of them were entitled like that. Alrighty, I uh, didn't leave you Keep alone for now. Keep safe. Solstheim's still a dangerous place. I will mm. definitely keep that in mind. Okay, let's uh, go do the thing. That one thing. Uh, about the mines. That's what I was going to go to. So I'd have to go up here. Yo! Racist! That was not necessary. I mentioned being a cat. That's rude. Okay, so, we go down the mines this way. Raven Rock Mind. And, Raven Rock Mind. I meant mine, not the past tense of version. <sighs> My brain is just collapsing in on itself. Good lord. I need more caffeine. Give me a moment. Maybe if I reopen the mine, they'll be nice to me. I, I think that will probably be the case. Alright, well... Da fuck? Oh, that's all the light coming from the uh, door. That The window's boarded up. How the hell's the light coming through? Okay. I guess I shouldn't, you know, argue the point. Uh, what do we got for weight? Okay, Damn that'll work. Woman. I said to leave me be. Uh, Precious, last time you explored the mine, you almost fell to your death. I'm not spending the rest of my days as a widow. She's and got a I'm point. I'm telling you that I'll do whatever it takes to find my great-grandfather's remains. He's down here. I can feel it. That was almost two centuries ago. There may be nothing left to find. Just let me go, woman. Precious, you're an obstinate old fool and you're going to get yourself killed. She's got a point there, bud. You should probably listen to her. Then again, that goes into uh, saying that my father says a lot, uh, or said a lot, rather. Uh, <laughs> if a man's standing alone in a forest and his wife isn't around to hear him, he's still wrong. And that tends to hold true the majority of the time. So, uh, Who Crucius. Who places are you? Can't you see I'm busy? Uh, busy doing what? Arguing with your wife? Why should I tell you? I don't even know who you are. Well, I'm... I'm just exploring. I could probably help. Hmm. Maybe. Been difficult trusting people lately. They think I'm crazy. But mark my words. These mines hold a secret that could put Ravenrock back on the map. Fair enough. That is good to hear. Because I hope I could probably do that for these people. What sort of a secret would be hidden here? A secret the East Empire Company swept under the rug two centuries ago. Really? It killed my great-grandfather and left Ravenrock with a worthless and tainted mine. Really? That's... Kind of bad. Well, who was your great grandfather first? Gratian Kyrelius. He spent his entire life exploring ancient ruins across Tamriel. And he died in these very mines almost 200 years ago. Exploring ancient ruins, huh? How did he die? The East Empire Company called it a terrible accident, claiming that he was lost in a rockfall. But I know better. Uh huh. What's your proof? My wife and I were cleaning out our home, and we came across some of my great-grandfather's things locked in an old chest. Really? I found an unsent letter he'd written to the East Empire Company, and a key. Hmm, what did the letter say? It describes a discovery that was made in the mine by some of the diggers, 
They wanted Gratian to take a closer look. I assume that's a great East Empire great Company must have felt it was of great value, as they locked that section of the mine off from everyone else. Huh. The key is to the locked section, I assume? It is. Well, I assume it is. I haven't been able to find the entrance. Ah, fair enough. I admit, that does sound suspicious. Finally! Someone who believes me. Hey! I'm telling you, there's something big down there. Something that the East Empire Company wanted to hide from everyone. Why are you telling me all of this? Well, I did offer to help, but why? Look. My wife nags that I'm too old to go traipsing around these mines chasing my story. She's got a point. Time's my enemy. It's caught up with me before I could find the answers that I'm looking for. Yeah. So you do need my help. I do. I want to know what happened to Gratian. And what the East Empire Company is keeping from all of us. Any idea of where to start? Gratian kept a journal of notes about his discoveries. If you can find his remains, I'm hoping it will help. Well, Here's I'll try and look for it. The letter, the key. Please, do this for me. So I can finally regain the respect that I've lost. Alrighty, fair enough. I will do that for you. Uh, I'm not gonna ask that. That seems kind of douchey after everything I just talked about him with. Uh, why were you arg- uh, wait. This is more important. Glover wants his ancient Nordic pickaxe back. The damn fool doesn't even deserve to have it. The pickaxe was made for mining, not selling. I'll bet he stole it from the Skald in the first place. It doesn't belong to you. Oh, very well. Here, tell him I hope he drops a thing on his foot. <laughs> I will make sure he gets that message. Uh, do you know someone called Mirak, just on the off chance? I recognize the name, but I don't know how I know it. It sounds so familiar. Fair enough. Tell me anything you can. It's so strange. I feel like it's from a dream. Something about the Earth Stone. And a shrine. That's it. That's all I can think of. Huh. So it does prove that it's a connection all of them have. Strictly to the Earth Stone and the Shrine. And that's the only thing they can associate with Merak. Okay. Be careful down there. The mine can be treacherous. Fair enough. Why hey, are you leading Kishis on? I'll never understand. I'm not trying to lead him on. Uh... How did you meet him? To understand how we met one another, you have to appreciate what he's going through. Okay. Cretius is a third generation miner. All his life, he's lived and breathed nothing else. Fair enough. By the time Cretius came of age, the ebony mine in Raven Rock was shut down. He took that quite hard. Yeah, I bet. Why didn't he move somewhere else to find work? Our home has been in his family for over 200 years. Leaving would have been like abandoning precious memories. That's a good point. Instead, he stayed on Soul's time and spent most of his life prospecting for a new ebony source. Sadly, it never surfaced. That sucks. A decade ago, this drove him into a deep depression. He shut himself inside his home and refused to come out. Oh, man. This is where you met, I assume? It was. After refusing to allow anyone to bring him food. Counselor Morvane ordered his door to be knocked down before Cretius starved to death. Oh, jeez. I was a temple priest at the time, and they had me use my healing arts to restore strength to his ailing body. Hmm. I stayed for a while and cared for him. Then, I suppose we fell in love. You suppose? What do you mean, you suppose? I would think... <laughs> I would think that you understand a little bit more uh, than that. I'd hope, anyway. I'm guessing you don't quite agree with his story. Poor Cretius is aging, and I believe it's addled his mind. That's rude. As the years have passed, it's gotten worse. He's become obsessed with his theories of conspiracy. Then where's his great-grandfather? I'm sure he's down there somewhere. Buried under a mountain of rubble, like the East Empire Company claims. Uh-huh. My greatest fear is that my stubborn mule of a husband will end up suffering the same fate. That's a good point. Uh, but that's why he has me doing it for him. That's why. Be You're good on that. Here. You're good on that front. Okay. Speaking of... Oh, that was really weird. That was 
wacky. Okay, uh, just checking what we got over here. I do not need the other pickaxe anymore, I don't think. Uh, I could sell that, that's for sure. Definitely with that sort of weight on it. Okay. I'm not leading him on, I'm helping him, thank you. Very much. Uh, where is the entrance to the damn mine in the first place? It's down here? Yeah! It's down here. Alright. Sounds good. I'm gonna go down here. Like I should be. Because there's things going on down here. Oh, should mark that on my... Uh, uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da quest log. Oh! Oh, ba doodle! Ew, little shit. There you go. Take that. Bass. Uh, whoop. Okay. And we got a frostbite spider. There we go. Are they freaking out up there? Because I'm fighting down here? It sounded like it. Oh. Anyway. I'm gonna... Check if there's anything else going on. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Not right now, anyway. That is a longer drop than it probably should be. Alrighty. Well, now that I'm done with that, I'm going to leave it alone for now and do it in the next episode. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat playing games and mining for you.